If you've been to any big event in Kansas City in the past few years, you've probably seen the handiwork of our next guest. Let's just say her creations are pretty hard to miss. I am so excited to have this super talented Molly Balloons here today. <laughs> and could we, I, we need to point out this dress, all balloons. All balloons. Except the rhinestones. And the rhinestones. Those are rhinestones. I, and this girl hugs me in this dress. It's real, you can. It, it doesn't come. <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> She's way more frightened than I am. <laughs> okay, we have to take it back a few years. When did you start making these kinds of creations? Yeah, absolutely. Hang on, hold oh, that thought. Okay. I brought you something. Oh my gosh, oops, I accidentally matched your outfit color. <laughs> it matches wow. perfectly. <gasps> Oh my god. Oh my gosh, you look great. Amazing. I mean, not as good as you, but stop it. Really. Okay, so <laughs> learned how to make balloons, bored in my parents' basement when I was like nine, ten. Okay. My mother got me a how to make balloons book <laughs> from my clearance section at Borders. Okay. Who knew that would turn into a career? Uh, fast forward a couple years, summer before high school, picked it back up, realized like, oh, this could be a fun thing I could right. maybe make money at. So I called Chick-fil-A on the corner of 119th and Black Bob. Okay. And I lied. And I said, hi. I'm a local professional balloon artist. Would you like to hire me for your kids' events? <laughs> and they said yes, and I was like, oh gosh, what, oh, what now? <laughs> so then I got my balloon apron, I got my business cards, I got my Facebook page, I got you my got serious outfit. Quit. Yeah, I rolled my sleeves up. Okay. Somebody asked for a dog, I gave, or somebody asked for a cat, I gave him a dog, and I said, here's your cat. <laughs> Just sort of faked it till I made it. Yeah. Uh, nurtured it as a side hustle throughout high school. Then senior year rolled around. And I wanted to be homecoming queen. <laughs> and there's only one way to do that. A couple. Make but a one balloon. of the ways <laughs> was to make a balloon dress, and it worked. And and so that was so the you beginning showed of up in this dress, I made of balloons. Look at the boob area. <laughs> I didn't you, know you sizing you as well. Up a little. <laughs> You've uh, definitely honed your craft. Yeah, but right? this is impressive. Thank you. Okay, but then your business really started to take mm -hmm. off when the Royals went to the World Series, right? Yeah. So I told Facebook that, hey, I'll make a balloon dress for every game of the World Series if we go to the World Series, <laughs> which meant I had to do it. Look then at these we dresses. Did, and we won. And so I made one for every game of the World Series. Didn't sleep much, but it was a great week, and that's you when might I, have been their good luck charm. I'll take it. <laughs> I disagree, but I'll take it. Um, so I honed not only honed my craft, but my name in Kansas City became a thing, right. and now it's been like a legitimate full time. Yeah. So now, who are you making these amazing creations for? Mostly me. I do some custom dresses, but right. most I get hired to show up to your event wearing balloons, either on stilts or like a cocktail dress themed to your event, and I'm like a walking art installation, sometimes with extra models. Can you actually like move in these things? Oh, yeah. I mean, you're moving, but I am like. <laughs> oh, you can totally move. Depending on the style right. of the dress. I mean, the camera's not even on Yeah, me, we but... need to show her moving. Okay, do it again. We need to see her moving. Like, so incredible. Tons. And if there's more flair, you can like, you can. What happens when they pop? Do they ever pop? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So what, I Fixed mean. one in the bathroom 20 minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> but it's just, it doesn't unravel. A lot of people okay. think a balloon dress pops and it's like, yeah. oh gosh. <laughs> By the not. end of the night, you're yeah, still like in, you're covered. Or like a just a one fur and you can repair it. Okay. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> what inspired you to do this? Like, why did you decide <laughs> to make the dress? Well, it was the homecoming thing that was yeah. the catalyst. And then it was just one thing after another. And a lot of my fascination, oh, that picture is a fun one. That was in That's Qatar. Amazing. I didn't even know that wasn't a map until I got hired to go there. <laughs> and I was a balloon dragon on stilts for 10 days. Molly, like, where will you go next? I can only imagine. I don't know. Vegas next week. You want to come? <laughs> yes. <laughs>